Here we have the 2021 Toyota 4Runner SR5 four-wheel drive. Comes with a four-liter six-cylinder engine and automatic transmission in a beautiful gray color. Let's take a peek inside. From inside, we do have a nice little armrest here with our power locks windows right there as well. We have our power mirrors just on the inside. Running boards help us get up. Also have that gray and black premium upholstery, uh, leather that is, and power driver and lumbar support. Let's take a look inside this runner. Left side, like I said, you got power mirrors, our Doji Gauge cluster dimming, our automatic headlights, or fog lights, I mean. Also have our windshield wiper de-icer. Left side here, that's where our automatic headlights are. On the right side, we have our rain wiper controls. Left here, we have our audio, radio, and Bluetooth controls. On the right side, we have our cruise control functions, our adaptive cruise control function right there. As well, we do have uh, some buttons here to control what we're seeing on the digital gauge, which we go into right now. First thing you see is our digital speedometer, our sway warning, a blank screen, your after start information, your after reset information, your after refuel information, your eco indicator, and back to our speed there. You got tire pressure information as well as our steering angle. Whatever auto you have playing will show up there. Have our driver assistance information right here as well. We have to have the lane departure assist and the pre collision system as well, which is kind of nice. Also, we have the tire pressure warning system like we kind of went through with earlier, and our meter settings are for us as well. Over to the infotainment here, just above that, we do have our clock two air vents, hazard lights, uh, check out our sources here of the radio, we do have AM, FM, Sirius, XM, USB, and Bluetooth, also do have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, which is kind of nice there for us as well. With me Mini here, you can connect your phone via Bluetooth if you'd like, and if you do, you'll have access to your recent messages and all that good stuff, obviously my phone isn't connected right now. Apps that you, you'll have more access to apps if you do connect your phone, but you have the remote connect authorization and the notifications. We do have our projection button for Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Uh, info section here is our eco and vehicle alert history as well we do have our setup settings like for our general settings uh like your beep theme setting your keyboard layout your bluetooth audio phone voice vehicle settings such as our vehicle customization valet mode and dealer info uh do have a map button here but we don't have a navigation app installed you have to check the toyota website for that but you do have apple carplay android auto so you can use that for your navigation needs have our power or uh, power volume rocker right here our tuner rocker right there uh dual zone climbing controls on each side uh we have front and rear defrost ac button there for us as well uh, usb and a 12 volt right there two cup holders nice drive mode selector here transmission shifter we'll take a peek at that backup camera also have heated seats for the driver and passenger with a couple different you can have it as hot or as cool as you want i have a power window button for the rear window as you can see bring that up up here we do have a power tilt slide sunroof with the controls for that right here. Some interior lighting options are universal garage door opener, our traction control, downhill assist, and eight track mode. Nice rear view mirror and a sunglass holder right there as well. Let's take a look outside. We have our LED headlights, a nice black and chrome finished grill there with that gray uh, bar across, Toyota badge in the middle. We have our big uh, Nexon Radian HTX2 tires, uh, 17 inch alloy rims as well. There's running boards there, got paint matching door handles and rear tinted windows with the SR5 badge right there with that nice silver roof rail. Come around to the beautiful 4Runner taillights here. LED taillights with our trailer tow package. Let's open up the trunk. Opens up nice and easy there for us. And these seats do also forward forward. The third row seating, you pull this, put the headrest down, and then pull this little tab and flip forward. The seats to fully go down. Obviously you can do the same with that side as well. You get tons of extra room. Let's take a look at those back seats. In the back, we have a nice little armrest here with our power windows, tons of legroom, and a headroom here in the rear of this Toyota 4Runner SR5. We have that same gray and black upholstery, same as we have in the front. Make your way inside. Got those two rear air vents for your rear passengers, so you want that AC blowing a nice summer day today. Also have our two USB inputs there at the bottom. If you have someone, if you have no one in the middle seat, you can fold it down and get an armrest and an additional two cup holders there as well. And these seats do also fold forward a nice easy 40 split. Pull this tab up here. Seats down nice and easy for us. Easy access into the back seats. You got two more seats back there, which is kind of nice. Flip these back up super easy. Go back outside. That'll wrap it up for the 2021 Toyota 4 Runner SR5 four wheel drive in a beautiful dark gray color. If you have any questions or want to book a test drive, please feel free to visit us at parkmaz.ca. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll catch you in the next one. Have a good day.